Intrathecal application uh, is very important when we have a central nervous system problem. So it, it can be a medullar section, it can be something as easy as spinal stenosis, for example. So in these types of cases, it's very important for us to place the stem cells close to where the problem is. So intrathecal application is a very safe way of, of applying the stem cells in high concentrations in the, in the central nervous system. This is something that we need to do along with the IV treatment, which is going to be important. And, and this is because stem cells are not specific to a site. So there's going to be a lot of information around the body. And when we apply them woefully, if we don't apply a, a, a general a general bolus of stem cells, stem cells tend to leave the area to look for other places to exert their, their function. So by applying the IV along with the intrathecal in this case, we allow the stem cells to stay in the intrathecal area and exert their function and the, and the rest of the stem cells that we apply uh, as a general IV will go out to the rest of the body and look for other places where, where inflammation exists to, to start working and exert their, their function. I think we've had a lot of experience with, with these types of, uh, of applications and we've, we've been getting extremely good results with it. And uh, up to now, we haven't had any complications. Complications is not something that, that uh, concerns us a lot because stem cells, specifically speaking, mesenchymal stem cells, the, the, the ones we use, are very safe to use. They, they, I, don't, I don't think we've ever had a, a, a negative side effect. I, th I think the most we've had is, is hyperthermia. Uh, and sometimes we do get pain and inflammation in the site of injection. When we do a local injection, like a joint or even intrathecal, uh, sometimes patients will have a little bit of pain and inflammation that is very easily treated with, with, uh, with uh, pain medication.